Anyway, what was I on about? Maybe jumping? Texting? Oh, right, um, the message. So we're half an hour late. Try. Format C, dude. Format C. Uh, also, two computers out of out of three, and in this little lobby is uh, out of commission, really. Blue screening. Right, so... I don't know, let's go over with the controls. So the controls are, like I said, uh, devs, uh, artistic liberties. When you're making a remake... What a name, Tsaruhas. Good morning, Dr. Freeman. Good morning. There was someone downstairs asking about you. Or was it upstairs? Yeah, would you know? I'm rather busy now. If you say so, there's nothing going on here. Fine. I don't know, we've got a game to play, right? Um, so the artistic liberty. And the guys are just going on and on about everything. It's just hard to focus, isn't it? Like somebody here owes this morning. Good morning, Freeman. <laughs> oh, hey, another different um, female scientist model. That's interesting. I don't really. That's not too Big bad on me that today, I didn't remember. Eh, Freeman? Oh, you don't even know. Just hold on for a moment. Why? They need you in the test Justin. chamber. Surely. So anyway. The sample was just sent down to the test chamber. Yeah, like I said, it's hard to focus when everyone's talking to you. Um, artistic liberty. So, you know, when you want to remake something, there is a lot, a lot to consider. If you're the original fucking developer, you know what you wanted to do. And what you've done is a combination of your artistic vision and the capability of a, a current or contemporary um, technology. Oh, hey, look, there's the J-Dude again. We've been over this. I said we're gonna meet him again. So the contemporary technology really, you know, didn't allow for the graphical fancy shit and shit. But the game gameplay was already solid, you know. You can shoot, you can run, jump, shit like that. If if they really tried, you could... Well, they could have implemented um, climbing and shit like that. But, again, like I said, there was jumping and there was crouch jumping. Seems to me that he's just spouting buzzwords in his research papers. He picked up from perusing popular scientific periodicals. Surely. So, first thing that they've done, that they had no. Oh, hey. So, Jimeno, eventually, Jimeno, I don't know if you, if maybe it was visible from the window over there. Jimeno eventually uh, walks over and puts the blinds down so you don't see, because, you know, you're not authorized for that conversation. Should we be going this way yet? Probably not. Got the wrong airlock, Mr. Freeman. You know I can't let you through here. Well, if you say so. I was just exploring, right? You know. Fine. Anyway, um, if you're an original developer, you uh, make like a consensus. You have to balance your vision with the technology available. Anyway, and the gameplay was. Certain. The gameplay was solid already, but here, hey, let's distract ourselves some more. How much recognition do you think you're going to get for reproduction, though? You should focus on inventing something new and unique. He does have a point. Oh, but this is more than replication. I assure you. And this is a very important conversation they're having. They're having, even if you don't know. There's a big crisis in reproduction of studies right now. Because uh, no one's really doing reproductions, and why isn't anyone doing reproductions of studies? Because that doesn't really bring in the views. Uh, if you want to be famous in science, you really need to figure out something new and, and unique. That's true. Or, or m prove that the previous uh, theory and anything was incomplete or, or outright wrong. But reproduction is very important. Reproduction lets us know that the um, science done previously is actually fucking uh, solid. But no one wants to publish it because it's, you know, it's not new. It doesn't bring in the views. And that's bad because science, they, you know, you can just, you can pretty much just make shit up, put it into the papers, and no one will test it to verify if, if it's real. And you'll get your Nobel Prize for something or another. And no one will check it, and you will be selling snake oil. And until someone tries to use it in an invention, 
Um, no one will be really able to tell you if anything is wrong with, with what you've done. Um, but then again, a lot of the uh, fucking science is, oh hey, someone's Dr. Cross. Did you call me Dr. Cross? Who are you calling Dr. Cross? The table of fucking the wall with the gauges? We can talk later, Gordon. Why? Are you calling the wall Dr. Cross? Are you mental? Have you gone bonkers yet? Possibly. Are you trying to figure out all the new sciences that haven't been figured out yet? Oh, Dr. Cross. oh no, I get it. Ah, Dr. Cross fancy seeing you here. He's trying to <laughs> start the conversation, you know, because he's a fucking nerd and he fancies Dr. Cross. Who the fuck is Dr. Cross? Is she hot? Probably not. No, it's fine. You do you. Uh, so yeah, as a developer, this again, this started as a fan project, so that's an important information. Hello, this is Annoyed Woman and a Pun Master. So, you probably know, this is the famed uh, microwave oven that cooks up some sort of meal for you know who, for Ferguson actually. And here it is. It sits right there in the microwave that's not on. So let's put it on so the food is warm, right? What the hell? Yeah, what the hell? It's been like seven or eight seconds and the meat meal blew up somehow. We will never hear the end of this. Yeah, you best make like an atom and split. Because uh, that was, um, that was you-know-who's lunch. But nothing is wrong. Again, again, this is fucking artistic liberty. Not only did they took liberties with controls, but they also took liberties with the presentation. So in the original game, when you start the microwave, it runs for a while, and then the, the contents actually blow up. There is nothing, nothing left there. Here, it just like, it's as if you microwave the fish, and, it, and the steam that collected inside of it just popped once and the fish is still there everything is fine only maybe it's uh, thrown a few bits here and there or instead of being one big fillet it's maybe split and maybe not even completely but there was no food left to gather from the original here you just had a bubble and when the good doctor rears his head. and that's supposedly unedible now this for anything he'll be fit to be tied you better make like a prom dress and take off and that's what he says. You better make like a nut and bolt. You better make like diarrhea and run. Yeah, not to be vulgar or, any or anything. Thanks, Dad. Would you like purple drank, maybe? Because we're gonna have a pu purple drank on our way to... What is it? Um, locker room. That's where we're headed. Authorized personnel only. Are we? We, sh we should. That's not here. And there's the locker room. Yeah, perfect. I share his sentiment. I fucking I don't understand uh, ties. It's not more elegant. What does it do? Cover up your buttons? Preposterous. Cover up your buttons? You know, you can get shirts that cover their buttons on their own. Like there's like a flap that covers their buttons. Also, maybe you've got very nice buttons on your shirt, so you maybe so they're designed to be shown off. Instead, you're wearing t a tie. And the tie came from like a tradition, well, it was war, right? And it was, I think, Italians that went to war. And women uh, of those guys gave them a little, what, what would it be? Like a scarf, like a scarf. Tied them on their, on their necks. And there we had it. Um, that's the ties. And it turned into a fashion accessory that can ch fucking kill you, choke you. Especially when you're working with uh, heavy machinery. And it's fucking dumb. Don't wear ties. No toilet paper. I have no idea who figured out that, uh, who came up with an idea that a tie would be something that it's worth bothering or requiring from others. Hello? Could somebody get me some toilet paper? So this is also kind of weird, because I don't know. I'm not sure, because when I came up and picked up the toilet paper roll, the tutorial showed up. And it should show up before I do the thing. Instead of relying on me knowing how to operate the game, the tutorial is for for you there, there for you to inform me how the game works. So that should 
show up before or something. Or maybe I should be skipping this and the tutorial would show up at the cart or something like that later in the game. So anyway, here. There should be a um thank heavens. I'm in dire need of some toilet paper. There should be an achievement in this game or the previous one for uh, providing the to toilet paper. But don't worry about it. I'm not worried about uh, the fucking uh, achievements. So here it is. There's three people authorized to use HEV, I guess. And one of them is us, and we're late. So yeah, artistic presentation didn't convey the story of the food being blown up, lost, and inedible. Wasted, essentially. Bit of a gamer moment there, so I let it play. Empty charge, and there's some armor here. Not like there's much of it, fucking 14 units, what the fuck. So, right, uh, we're equipped now and we can zoom in on points of interest. Can you read that? Yes, I, you can, that's very legible actually. Mark 4, I'm not gonna go over this, I zoomed in already if you want to read it. Um, sorry, this time no narration, I guess. <laughs> We've got things to go over. No, that's wrong. Power is 29%. Fuck you. Um, so, this is of course our me What is it? Massachusetts Institute of uh, Technology, MIT, obviously, for Gordon Freeman. Gordon Freeman is barely legible. Again, with this uh, jump in technology and remaking, his diploma could take the you know moment of making legible and making... Uh, you know, looking good. Also, we're a theoretical physicist, and there is a beaker here, I don't know why. And there is this picture of a child. I don't know who that is. Is that Gordon? Why would he have his infancy picture in his locker? Is this his child? It shouldn't be. He's 27. And, well, you know, no one really tells anyone that Gordon would have had a child, or it's not like he yeah, boasted or anything. What is this? Color polish? So I guess we've got a car, or a garden, or a garden that does, and a red one that does as well, and and a box of whatever. It's probably empty anyway. Yeah, it's empty, but should be something. Should I break my own cup mug? Probably, probably not. I just want to know if there's any print on it. Well, shit. I guess no print. And I guess a suit? Well, yeah, probably the khakis and the uh, silly tie. Probably. So, great. We're over this. Artistic liber liberty took... Uh, liberty took away the ability to comprehend the situation that happened. Uh, in the kitchen. Yeah, and now you're old and nobody likes you. Mind you, the base color wasn't so loud. You know, it is a hazardous environment suit that should keep you away and um, safe, and let others know that you're around in this. Because you know, you might have been under radiation. You might still be radiating, so they would see you. It's orange. Helmet it's wasn't safe. Optional or ventilated. There wasn't an integrated waste disposal system either. Count your lucky stars. So does that mean you can piss yourself? Or does it include shitting yourself as well? If you want to shit yourself, get an HEV suit. Mark IV, at least. Have you ever seen those electromyographic sensors in the old biomechatronic Mark I? A no. A marvel of modern engineering. Well, now we've got Mark IV and it's better, I guess. So fuck you, dude. We're not gonna be staying here. Also, you know, I don't know whose names are these. Is If it's developers of the original game or the mods. Because... They needed names, all they needed to do is put something over there. Our can is still here, great, right? I'm not gonna pick it up. Oh, right, there was a joke I, was, I wanted to do. 
You better make like a bus boy and get the fork out of here. Pick up the can. No, throw it to the trash can. <laughs> she doesn't even know. Do you know? You should have known. Right, so we're going down which way? Probably towards the, the lab. This was the uh, airlock that's not allowed for us, at least now, because, you know, we're going somewhere. Research, development, and personnel. Pers we've been in personnel. And this is research. But then again, I don't know. Well, anyway, I'm pretty sure we're going this way. And also, Gordon is late, half an hour late. And apparently it's not his first time, but no one fires him. I mean, this is a very big day. We, we're having a um, very important um, sides to do. And we're just fucking about, right? We're half an hour late and there is no one to take our place. There isn't like an extra guy who could do that. There isn't stuff um, that would be available anyway. There's three dudes um, running every hazardous material or hazardous um, shit to do. Uh, in the whole facility, and you're the only one who's late, and no one has fired you yet, and you weren't fired, really, and you probably won't be fired. So how important are you? Fuck me. Go right on through, sir. Yeah. Dude, your life must be boring. Yeah, you're talking about my suit. Um, this life must be boring. I mean, of course, he's security, and he should be guarding the door, but maybe give him a booth. Have him fucking sit on the fucking bench so he can, you know, it's not far. He can sit down here and be like, oh, you're going? No, you can't go here. I'm security. Or be like, oh, you're coming. You're allowed, so you should go through. Like you, me, Gordon Freeman. There we go. Right, so Gordon, Gordon really is a person that's... What's the phrase again? Greetings and Irreplaceable. Salutations, Dr. Freeman. Right. You're not a dork at all, are you? Working as a team. Innovation. No repeatability. That's what we want. In Black Mesa. Just figure something new out. Maybe it was a fluke. Maybe not. Who cares? It worked once. Just keep doing it until you get a different result. Definition of insanity? I we have no idea what you're talking about. Responsible. Oh, should I be reading this? Not, not, not necessarily. Again. I've, I'm looking at it. Recycling? Recycling. Um. Oh, hey, technology. I like that. Hydroelectric dam. We'll be there eventually. And we've made a circle, I guess. That's good. So, uh, the microwave doesn't blow up, so it doesn't convey the idea that the meal is no longer edible, so you'd be in trouble for wasting food, and somebody else's food as that, at that, and the controls of jumping. So, the original team, like I said, uh, provided you with a tutorial of some sort and let you use jump to jump over obstacles and also a crouch jump to get higher but the devs of this game decided that you don't really need jump and they really like uh, crouch jumping and that's an issue like I said if you've got a function that just works fine you decided to make it obsolete and redundant and stuck things on top of it and make only that uh, any useful so I already put in uh, some work, I already changed a few files and you can check out my little short about that if you're uh, struggling with your uh, Black Mesa and if it's shit. So, Because, like I said, the option of always crouch jumping is shit. That's just fucking stupid. Like I said, later on you'll be having uh, the extra module for different jumping, for more jumping. And if you're always uh, crouch jumping, you'll never get any height. And that's an option for you as well. It's a fucking jetpack after all. Maybe let me get some height. Maybe. Uh, but no, with crouch jumping you won't really get that. So that's bad. Um, right, so the, the option of double jumping is, is bad. Well, crouch jumping. Oh, there, it's blocked? Is it ever opened? Maybe later once everything will go to shit. I mean, it's not like it's much of a spoiler, is it? I mean, we played the game number two already, and they already told us about the seven hour uh, war and shit like that, and all the consequences of Black Mesa incident. So, yeah, there's that. Um, what's in here? That looks weird. 
Shouldn't the sign be the other way around? Haven't you just fucked it up? Haven't you looked? Why would you mirror it at all in the first place? Press stop. Stop for fucking ruining the, the signs and symbols. Signs. They've got one meaning. 